Hi, everybody. Um, gonna do another live tonight. Look at that sparkle. Okay, so we're gonna go through some jewelry, and back there is um, beautiful crystal bottle. And I hung the necklace on there because it's such a beauty. But, so we have a few things to show here tonight. I don't know if I'll ever get the lighting correct. Go on the road. Road on the show, right? Okay. And that's a beautiful crystal bowl over there. That thing weighs 10 pounds, 2 ounces. Oh, okay, we're back. I don't know, something happened here with my internet. Anyways, let's um, see if I can get this um, in the right position. Okay. How about if I do this? Is that better? Okay, so I haven't, like, invited anybody to these lives. So right now it'll just probably come out as a video. So let's start with this bracelet. Many things I do not know the names, uh, the brand, the maker... Here is um, the bangle, and it opens up, which it works. For some reason, I'm having a problem with this connecting. I'm going to try, let me see if this works. Okay, let's see if this works. Okay, so back to the bracelet. It's really, really nice. Um, and here it opens. And there's this one, which is really just costume jewelry. They're pretty good sized beads. And we have another one here, purple. Let's see if I can get it up there close for you. Let's hope my connection to the internet stays. And this also opens like this. And I don't believe I saw a brand on it because if I did I think I would have wrote it down then I have this pretty necklace that's sideways but when you hang it down they they hang to the side of the chain And one I really wanted to show you, I just thought was beautiful. And it's this one that was hanging on the decanter. All these crystals on it. It's really like a collar choker chain, mostly. Uh, I mean, there's an extension on it. Um, so it could come down a little ways from your neck. I don't like things tight on the neck. But let me see if I can pull this back. I'm using my phone to do these lives with. So you'll have to excuse the... Um, <laughs> 
craziness of it all. Then we have this necklace. Which is long. Boy, this isn't working so great for me tonight. I don't know what it is, but so this is a long pearl necklace. You could um, double it around your neck. And it has the lobster claw. I guess I had this set up differently tonight. That's the problem. Okay. Then we have, have this other um, pretty bracelet that I'm taking it out of the bag. You have to excuse me. This is way I do it so um and here we have it oh dear god help me <laughs> I guess I need a bigger area to do this in And, yes, it comes apart. It has this latch on it that goes over the little nub there. And so it's a... UTC 925 made in Italy um, sterling silver vermeil rope it's a oval bangle bracelet um, which is actually um, the weight of it's like 20 to 20.5 grams um, and I forget how big a wrist size it is, but anyways, um, I'll go on to the next one. I got to do this different, guys. This is uh, not working for me. I need to be able to pull it back farther so you can get a better picture of everything. Um... How about this pretty butterfly brooch? Let me see. Let me put this in here. And let me pull this back. And let's get this brooch under the light. I do not see a name on it. It's really pretty. It has pink stones in it. And a couple of little faux pearls, which I believe are faux. Um, huh. Maybe that's a little better for you. It's really pretty, though. Um... So the next one, what do I want to show you next? Um, I have another bracelet. Uh, no, let me show you. I'll show you this pen. Um, it has copper on it. Copper and beads. Here's the back. You can see where the beads are strung through there with a piece of copper wire. Okay. 
right? And I have this is heavy. This the stones are big on it, and um, I don't know if I know the weight of this necklace, but look at this baby. Let me see if I can pull it all the way away from it so you can see it. Oh, that's not working so great that way either. But it's it's pretty heavy. Um, let me bring the beads up closer. Nice and cold, like stone should be. And here's the clasp. And yeah, I do have a few different um, ones with the blue stone. I won't say turquoise. Um, because some of them... Oh, I'm telling you, these are heavy though. But this is a chunky turquoise necklace and apple coral bead. It's 925 sterling silver parts in there. The closure is a lobster claw. Um, it weighs 140 grams or 4.95 ounces, and that's the necklace itself. So that's kind of a heavy little thing here. Um, my point in showing these is so you can see how, you know, a lot of nice stuff that, and I, I will be putting it on, um, oh, some things are going to be going on an auction site. And some I will just do uh, myself, like maybe on Facebook or wherever. But um, here is a, a Kate Spade bracelet. And it opens like this. And that's like a, it's like a pink corally color. Let me see if I can get it up there for you to see it closer. And here's the Kate Spade of New York, which is upside down. There you go. Okay. It's a gold tone cuff. So now, um, I promise you I'll find better ways to do this, guys. Okay, and I have this beautiful snowflake. Boy, this just doesn't look right to me tonight. What is wrong here? I should take it out. But this is just previews. And then I have... This gold heart with the pearls on the bottom. It's a brooch. And then I have this beautiful purple one. And this one is a, the mark on it is JJ. The teacher's desk and here's another cuff with crystals in it and I guess it's still in the bag and the cuff has an opening so you would slide it on over your wrist then we have 
Um, this is a, a J. Crew necklace, which I'm sure some of you have seen before. Still has where to go. The tag that tells what it is. But I just thought that was pretty. And uh, let me see. This one is. Hang on one second. Okay. So this one is a footnote. Stainless steel expandable charm. Um, and this one has three little things on it. Let me see if I, I can hold it right. Oh, it's turned backwards. <laughs> okay. Well, let me see if I can do it this way. Nope, it just doesn't want to show its sparkle. What can I say? So it has three things on it, and it's um, footnote, stainless steel expandable charm bracelet at Grace. Okay. I really apologize for uh, not being able to show this the best way possible. Um, and I have a mosaic cross which has um, Oh, one second. Which has... Well, this is it right here. And you can see the stones in there. There's a couple of little crystals in there, too. So this one, the height of this is... Uh, oh, I forget now. <laughs> But it's a mosaic cross with coral, turquoise, and other stones and crystals. Hmm. And next we have this one's kind of pretty. I'm uh, not sure about all the stones in it, but um, Monumento. Un momento. Okay, here we go. It's just kind of, the, the things need to be flattened out a little bit, but here's here's this part of it. And there's crystals and reminds me kind of Indian like and here's the stones they're really uh, pretty very earthy And it's not super long. And this one also is the lobster claw class. Um, oh, let me see here. What else can I show you? Um, here's this one. I do not know 
who it's made by because there's nothing on there that I could find anyways if I can ever get it open. Um, just thought it was kind of neat though. That really like is supposed to hang in the middle. There we go. And the chain is uh, let me see. I thought maybe this had a hang tag, but you know what? I don't see one. And it smells like silver. But I I haven't found anything yet that states that it's silver so I can't definitely tell you that it is um what else would you like to see let me see I have quite a few boxes of oh uh, yeah here's a European style bracelet um similar to Pandora See if we can get it turned around. Okay, I have actually I have a lot of the European style beads with the glass and the silver and some that are um, a mixed metal, but a safe metal. Um, I also have this hummingbird pen that people have been begging me about. Um, let me see. Let me see if I can get it in this other light. Get it up closer so you can see the face. And here's the back. Sorry guys, I'm tired tonight. Okay. So then I have um, a twisted um, bangle that is, it's a silver bracelet, but it's a Viking style, a Norse twisted silver bracelet. Um, Now, I can't find, like, you know, a name on it, like, uh, George Jensen or, you know, but let me see if I can get this up here where you can see it. Okay. Now, I have um, a few other things, but I think I'm going to cut this short now because I need to upload it to YouTube. But here, I wanted to share this too. This is a double spouted pot and it's from Peru. Pretty interesting. There's the back. There's the bottom. Here's the spouts. I 
And also, I just I love this crystal um, liquor bottle. I have, of course, the this pretty necklace hanging on it. That's the Natasha necklace. But here's the and it is um, lead crystal. It's um Sambori. And again, this, I have this big one right here. It's ten pounder. <laughs> it's a tulip. Uh, All right, guys. I'm going to let you go. Talk to you later.